Hi there. This is Dr. Pan recording from Tucson, Arizona. Thank you for watching this clip on solving log equations. We have a very similar equations over here. Depend on where the parenthesis here versus here, it makes a huge difference because for this one, two times log of x is by itself versus this one is two times log of x minus four. So let's solve both equations. Let's say equation one, let's solve it here first. First thing we're gonna do is we're gonna put everything back onto the exponents. The log property says if you have a two in the front, you can put it in a hat. Minus means subtract uh, division. So we'll, but we'll do it uh, little by little. X minus four, I'm gonna put this hat back on in there as well. Next, then we're gonna use the property that if it's minus, it's four squared is 16 here, Divide, dividing, and if it's multiplying, uh, adding here is multiplying, so x minus four squared equal to zero. Next, I'm gonna use the property, how to transfer this one back into exponentials so it can solve it. We're gonna keep the same base, I'm gonna take this number and put it on exponents, I'm going to leave whatever is here onto the other side. For square. Okay. So this is 1 is equal to 16 over 3, x minus 4 squared. And then I have x minus 4, the whole thing squared, is equal to 3 over 16. And then I'm going to take square roots on both sides, so I have x minus 4 is equal to radical 3 plus minus divided by 4. Or x is equal to 4 plus minus radical 3 over 4. Okay, that's the solution if the parenthesis is right in here. Okay, now let's take a look at the second case. What happens if the parenthesis is elsewhere? Example 2. 2 log base 4 minus log 10 base 10 of 3 plus twice the log of x and the whole thing minus 4 equal to 0. Now for this case, we're going to combine all this as we did it before. So I have log base of 10. I'm going to write 10 back in there. I have a 16 divided by 3 times x squared. I'm going to put in this square back on there. And that is equal to 4, moving the 4 over, basically. And writing this one in exponential form, 10, same base, to the 4 power is equal to 16 over 3 x squared. Okay, from here, we can solve it. I'm running out of room here a little bit. So bear with me. Let's see if we can find a spot over here. Okay, so and from here, let's push up a little bit. So drag it over here. We're going to continue over here. And then my x is equal to, I'm going to take a radical root. This becomes 10 to the square, radical 3, plus minus, and then divided by 4. So x is equal to one more step over here. So it's 25 times plus minus radical 3. So that's, that's the final answer. So it does make quite a bit of difference where the parenthesis is. All right, that's how we handle logarithm equations. And I hope it's clear. Please leave a comment on YouTube and let me know if it helped you. Until next time, have a confident day.